हेलो वेलकम टू द सेल्फ लर्निंग पॉडकास्ट बाय डॉक्टर सुषमा सिंह लेट अस स्टार्ट डिस्कशन ऑन यूनिट थर्टी यूजिंग एस पी एस एस फॉर डाटा एनालिसिस कंटेंट्स एंड आवर टॉपिक इज मल्टी वेरियंट एनालिसिस समटाइम यू मे बी इंटरेस्टेड इन एक्सप्लोरिंग कंप्लेक्स रिलेशनशिप इन्वॉल्विंग मोर देन टू वेरिएबल्स in this section you will learn how to cross tabulate your data for the analysis of relationship between more than two variables similarly how to compute multiple regression analysis has also been covered the first one is elaboration of cross tabulate In the earlier section you have learned the cross tabulation of two variables you can introduce a third variable by subgrouping one of the two variables this can be done by introducing a variable as control variable a control variable decomposes the data into subgroups based on the categories of the control variable in income group and sex distribution of the pearson's martial status cross tabulation you will find cross tabulation of martial status by income group of married unmarried and widowed persons with their sex distribution this is a good example that you can try and use in your own research now let us discuss to multiple regression in two variable linear regression you have used one dependent variable and one independent variable the multivariate regression is used to investigate the relationship between two or more independent variables on a single dependent variable the procedure for computing the statistics for multiple regression is the same as that for two variable linear regression explained earlier except that you have more than one variable under independent area in the linear regression dialog box now let us discuss the tests of significance in this section you will learn one sample t test for a mean two sample t test for the equality of means and chi square test for independence one sample t test compares the sample means to a population mean using t distribution as the standard of comparison sometime our data analysis focuses on two distinct group within a single population or we may want to compare the two populations in terms of their respective means the two sample t test for the equality of means will help us in this the chi square test for the testing of independence of attribute is for the categorically data arranged in a cross tabulation the chi square test appears as an option within the procedure for generating a cross tabulation the steps for chi square test are repeat of steps for generating cross tabulation with the addition of expected counts under the cells and chi square under statistics now let us conclude the unit in this unit you have learned the use of, of the spss program to enter the data in a data file and use this data file for the analysis of data you might have generated a data file using some other database programs such as excel it is very easy to convert such data files into a SPSS pss data file this unit provides an introduction to the spss you can do a range of statistical analysis from simple cross tabulation to more complex statistical techniques depending upon the individual researcher's requirement 
However, we have tried to explain only simple commands and statistical tools which are more popular in social research. We will leave it to the student to try and learn the full range of features in SPSS. Now let us wind up the session and we have come to the end of the unit. Thank you very much for engaging yourself with the self-learning podcast.